Hello students, I hope all of you are doing well and fine. Myself Lohit Jindal and I welcome you all in our next session of IFM 10 marker series guys. As you guys must be knowing by now, we are picking such kind of questions which you can expect to be on the level of 10 markers in the coming IFM. Okay, so without any delay, let us see this question. Guys, the question I have picked today, again, it is a previous year RMO question. So you can kind of expect it to be on the similar level of 10 marker series, 10 marker level, right? But the thing is, you might feel that the question is easy, hai, but only after you uh, see the solution. Otherwise, you might feel that it was quite tricky. But I assure you, the method we use to solve this question is quite interesting. Okay, it's a very interesting method, it will not come in the mind. So let us see this question hai na, without any delay. But yes, before starting, I would like to ask you, request you one thing guys. Please try this question by yourself first. First, you try this question by yourself. फिर ही आप इसका सलूशन देखना आफ्टर वाचिंग क्वेश्चन आफ्टर सीइंग द क्वेश्चन प्लीज ट्राई इट बाय योरसेल्फ फर्स्ट ठीक है तो खुद से ट्राई करो गाइस इस क्वेश्चन को पहले ओके सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन हियर यू हैव टू फाइंड ऑल पॉजिटिव रियल नंबर्स एक्स वाई एंड जेड सच दैट दीस थ्री इक्वेशंस आर सेटिस्फाइड राइट सो प्लीज गाइस पॉज दिस वीडियो हियर एंड ट्राई टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन एंड इफ यू आर एबल टू सॉल्व इट देन दैट इज वेल एंड गुड दैट इज वेरी गुड एंड इफ यू आर नॉट एबल टू सॉल्व इट नॉट नॉट अ बिग डील प्लीज ट्राई टू but please give it an attempt for at least 20 minutes to half an hour so that later on when you watch the solution you actually get to retain those concepts with you okay because since you would have tried it you know given it a good attempt and spent time on it aapko better samajh mein aega and you'll have a good retaining power for that okay all right let us see this question guys so xyz ke liye hume positive real numbers xyz so that these three questions are satisfied one thing that we can observe here is this is these are quite in a symmetric or you can say cyclic order है ना? So let us add these three equations. Add करोगे तो guys क्या होगा? 2x, 2x will get cancelled, है ना? 2y, 2y will get cancelled, 2z and 2z will get cancelled. But you'll get adding all three, you get y upon x on the left hand side. You'll be left with, okay, just let me write it a second. One upon x plus one upon y plus one upon z will be equal to three times one upon 2014. Right, this is what you are left with, right? Now, guys, what if we would have taken the LCM now? Okay, what if for this three set, equations of three set, I have would have taken the LCM, I would be getting two x z minus two y z plus one is equal to z upon two thousand fourteen, right? Second equation will be two x y two x y minus two z x. Plus one is equal to x upon two thousand fourteen, and the third equation is two y z minus two x y plus one is equal to y upon two thousand fourteen. But now add these three. Okay, now add these three. What you'll get now? देखो guys, now this time around 2xy, 2yz and 2zx will get cancelled, right? On the left hand side you'll get 3. On the left right hand side you'll get x plus y plus z in the numerator. Those 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 terms will get added because denominator is the same divided by 2014. Correct? This is what you'll get, right? Now, guys, I want to bring one thing to your notice, right? Now, uh, okay. First of all, let me name this equation as equation number one, and this equation x plus y plus z is equal to three times two thousand fourteen. This is as a second equation. So you have got these two equations, guys. But since x y z are positive real numbers one thing we should think about here is this is one of the hint you know lying in the question there positive real numbers hain. and once you get these two equations you should you know think about such a thing that what if you apply am greater than equal to hm on these hai na you might have seen these things what if i apply am greater than equal to hm on x y and z simply 
what does it give you it gives you x plus y plus z x plus y plus z by 3 is greater than equal to is greater than equal to 3 divided by 1 upon x plus 1 upon y plus 1 upon z this is what is am greater than equal to hm right now if you cross multiply guys other up is cross multiply karte ho, you'll observe that you are getting x plus y plus z into 1 upon x plus 1 upon y plus 1 upon z is greater than equal to 9 right that are getting greater than equal to 9 so guys if this product now is greater than equal to 9 but on the left hand side from equation number 1 and 2 if you look at them carefully what is the actual product of those two terms on the left hand side you put value this value is how much x plus y plus z is 3 into 2014 and this value is further 3 upon 2014 from equation number 1 so you will observe that these terms are getting cancelled 2014 2014 get getting cancelled or 9 equal to 9 are right so that 9 is equal to 9 so basically the expression on the left hand side is attaining the value 9 right which is the minimum value of the expression that we know right side from am greater than equal to hm we found that the value of the expression is always greater than equal to 9 and it will be equal to 9 in the case of x equal to y equal to z we know that from am greater than equal to hm right equality holds true in case of equality holds true in case for if you are applying on x, y, z, x equal to y equal to z, it will hold true in that case and it is coming out to be minimum, the product is 9, right, the product is coming out to be 9, that means what, that x should be equal to y is equal to z is your solution from this thing, right, that x equal to y equal to z should be your solution since equality is holding true, right, on the left hand side, so 9 equal to 9, 3 into 3, this value is 9, and you're getting it to be greater than or equal to 9 right so that will ensure that the value is so that x equal to y equal to z and using that if you put it in any one of the equation if x y and z are equal those will get cancelled you'll actually get this thing that 1 upon x equal to 1 upon y equal to 1 upon z you're getting to be 1 upon 2014 or in other words you're getting x equal to y equal to z equal to 2014 right so that is your final answer only one set of solutions for these three equations for three given equations and the solution is all three of them are equal all the three variables x y z have to be equal and they have to be equal to 2014 to get to the uh, to you know satisfy the given equation set of equations right so it was quite interesting a concept very interesting am greater than equal to hm use kar kya. identify kar rahe, rather you can you know, uh, pretty much ensure ki haan, yehi answer over, there is no other answer. Because that value, the product of those two terms is greater than or equal to 9 and it is equal to 9 only for this particular scenario. No other case, it is true, right? We have learned that in AM greater than or equal to HM, right? So, I hope guys, aapko ye question samaj mein aaya and you guys learnt a good amount of things from this and it's a very interesting way to solve this kind of question, right? So, I hope guys, aapko samaj mein aaya question aur maza bhi aaya and I hope that you did, you did uh, you know, understand this question. And if you did, please like this video and subscribe to our channel so that you keep getting regular updates, right? So all the best, guys. Till then, keep practicing and all the best. Take care. Bye-bye, guys.